we are going to be discussing the Panasonic splice tapes. The first generation of splice tape for the Panasonic machines was this one without a gap. Basically has a perforation there to be able to peel the cover tape back. The new generation that we made has a gap which allows your pick and place machine to peel without uh, any jams at all. And that's the reason we designed this new one to prevent jams. We will put this splice shim with the alignment pins up. We will put the pieces to be spliced in the carrier tape. You have a hold down unit to be able to hold the carrier tape down and have one hand free all the time. You have the other pieces will go in right there. We will then crimp the tool. And remove the splice piece from the tool. We will then remove the liner from the splice. We will then fold over the splice tape so that it is on the carrier tape on the top. You will see that there is two rails of tape, one on the sprocket drive holes and one on the component holes. We then will peel the clear plastic piece off which then will leave you a splice, both on the top and on the bottom. And this will make it easy for your machine to run and you will have the alignment pins covered to be able to detect a splice on a Panasonic pick and place machine.